Here we go, Trader's Corner, July 10th. It's the 10th of every month, July 2019. Here's what's going on now. There's gonna be a lot of announcements I'm gonna make during this, uh, this video that you need to pay attention to if you're a complete knife, crazy enthusiast, addict, very sick person like the rest of us are. Uh, please pay attention because I'm gonna tell you about some things that'll either save you a lot of money or a lot of grief, or a lot of heartache thinking you just missed something. Uh, so there's a lot going on out there, and no, I'm not aware of everything, but I'll tell you what, there's, uh, there's some stuff on my list all I can pile through for sure. Buy, sell, trade. This is really buy, sell, trade. You go into the comment section, hey, I got a Manic Sprint Run, and I want to trade it for this, or I want to buy something, I'm looking to buy some knife, or I'm looking to sell, or I'm looking to trade. So put your comments down there. That's what it's all about. That's the main thing these monthly buy, sell, trade, Trader's Corner videos are for. I don't anymore, I'm not going to do a knife sale on my Trader's Corner videos because I don't like combining it. It's going to be a mess doing that. So what I'm going to do, on Sunday the 14th, I'm gonna have a knife sale and it's gonna be a good one, uh, depending on what you're interested in. If you want Tucson knives, no. Ganzo knives, no. You want some higher end, really beautiful knives, yes. And some medium uh, that might be hard to get knives, yes. Uh, because we've got guys sending things in so they ain't mine necessarily. Mine might be a little boring. But these will be really nice because I've got some out there. I already got 15 knives sitting out there. I got 15 more coming in tomorrow. That'll be 30. I'll come up with 10. We'll have at least 40 on the table. Some of the knives on the sale will be for donation purposes to our Rockwell Machine Fund, which has already got four or five hundred dollars in there. So this I haven't even donated yet. Okay, I haven't even donated. So my knives some of them or whatever i choose i will donate so the proceeds to and i've got several others here that were part of the group that had sent some in to donate onto the uh, sale fund and there's others in our group that will have fundraisers as well so hopefully after the smoke clears sunday night or into monday morning on this sale that I'm going to be posting Sunday at 7 p.m. Eastern Time, 4 p.m. Pacific on the dot. Don't miss it or you will cry. Um, when the smoke clears from that, we'll probably be from the 500 up to 1,000 level with donations. Please consider donating. There's the PayPal payment address, right? So coolerkw at yahoo.com. We're going to get that Rockwell machine for Kurt. He can put it in his shop at home, and that way he doesn't have to crawl in at 4.30 in the morning just to try and get time on the machine there before he goes on shift or try and sneak in, you know, here or there, uh, lunch period and this and that to break up his life. No, but at least he's got the work one there for second checks on anomalous knives. Those few that will be way off for some reason and we will need to check. And we've got two other guys that will also be able to check so we can get four, maybe even five different people and machines involved if it really came to that in the future. And you know, if it does, it does. We will not hide our test results and we're gonna continue to build that database the more knives in there, the better. If you want to send a knife in for testing, you may suspect your knife is really, really soft steel. There's issues with it, whatever. Or you're just curious, or you know you think it would fill a hole in our database. Uh, in our database, I mean, even though we've got a lot of knives on there, you can't have too many. If you want to test one, contact me or one of the other guys in our group like uh, Blade Banner or Banner 247 or Super Steel Steve or In the Pockets, whoever, Tom Jose, 
and we will forward it in. Now, it's going to take right now, because we don't have this extra machine, it's going to take anywhere as a minimum of five weeks, because you got to figure mail time from you to me. I gather up other knives that are coming in, so I may sit on them three or four days before I turn around and send a box to Kurt, and then another four or five days there, then for him to get them in his lineup and actually have time to test them and then get all the printouts done and then send them back. So it's, it takes a while. Five weeks is probably a quick turnaround. I'd expect more like seven and maybe eight right now because we are backed up. I'm sending knives also in for cutting performance testing. So I'm kind of going around the backside and sending some to Outpost 76, do that then send them to Kurt and get an HRC on them, then we'll have that data complete there as to what we can gather for knives and give you know our viewers a picture and give us a picture. We, we are learning by compiling all this data. Uh, we're learning a lot. And I think our information will be passed on not only to the consumer public, but I think manufacturers might take a second look and even steel manufacturers as what their recommendations would be for proper HRC and or whatever based on real true world performance and uh, HRC data. So I'm gonna do that. Um, five bucks, 10 bucks, whatever you can do. Or if you wanna send a knife to me to put on a future sale, uh, no problem. And that would be a great contribution as well. A lot of us are probably more knife rich than we are cash rich. <laughs> Man, it's like that all the time for me. Okay, next uh, situation is CH knives. And I've reviewed a bunch of CH knives. And they these are G10 ones in D2. This is the O9. This is the O2 or 2002. This is uh, one of their new ones. It's a front flipper called the Toucan and this and that. But I was looking at uh, Justin's site, White Mountain Knives. LTK is your discount code for 10% off. White Mountain Knives. Check it out. He's got CH knives on there. I mean, titanium ones. He's got, he's got G10. Um, he got them through a source in China because he has Y-Start knives as well. So I looked and I'm going, these are not Y-Start knives. These are CH knives because, you know, it's got the logo. And he goes, you know, they just came in with a bunch of Y-Start knives. I just ordered them. And so now he's got them segregated out. So if you search, go to CH knife and look at the CH knives he's got. So you can buy them right here in the USA. You get something, this, you can return it, you know, normal things like normal retail. You're not waiting three weeks to get one. Um, I, I think, you know, this, this, these were like 32 or $33. You know, after your, uh, yeah, after your discount code, it's like 30 bucks and it's free shipping in the US. You'll get it in like three days. That's insane, right? It's insane. Kind of like some of their new packaging here. It's really cool. So, wow. Uh, go figure. Never thought it happened. Well, I did, but I didn't figure it happened that way. That was just very fortuitous, we might say. Okay, so next. And I will give you the link, White Mountain Knives. And, of course, use the LTK discount code. Uh, another thing is Tuya Knives, don't want to forget them. They have the Custoba, which I don't have here now. I send it in to get an HRC on it. So the Custoba, my buddy Michael Atorma, Storm Knives is the designer here. It's got titanium hardware and all that. And it's got the cool G10 uh, carbon fiber that are layered and then machined, you know, in different colors, that kind of thing. And of course, they've got the hive. These are coming back in. They pulled them. Yes, we found a low number. They double check. They go, damn it. Uh, we're not getting the correct information from our heat treater. So they pulled them and they will be coming back in. So do that. And the Kingsman, this is really something else. I, you know, 
I liked the look of it and everything, but when I got it in my hand, it was a whole different thing. Uh, the, how smooth this thing is. Is that insane? I mean, I've had a lot of knives in my hand, but that's a very hydraulic drop. That's just a beautiful drop. I love the look of it. The marble carbon fiber and everything. And I've had two of these in my hands and the action was the exact same. So crazy good. I'll be posting my review on that. Comes in this really cool box. There's all his information. I'll give you the link to his site. 5% off LTK discount code. So remember that. Olight, Olight, flashlights, okay? The 12th through the 16th, they're having their Elite Week sale, okay? I'll be posting a video Friday morning about this, but keep this in mind. They're the little mini uh, ball cream stuff, 40% uh, off on that. Uh, you get one of these little flashlights for free. The i3e flat dark earth, just a little light, I think 180 lumens max. Yeah, it's bright. Uh, it just twists on and off, double A battery, that kind of thing. But this is free when you have an account. If you don't, click on my affiliate link. It helps support my channel. Uh, but this will not be able, you cannot get this until Friday when they start the sale. And you can click on my link, establish an account, and you get one of these for free. If you already have an account, click on my link anyhow because it tells them it's coming from an affiliate. And yes, it does help support. It doesn't cost you anymore, but you can help support what we're doing here. Uh, and log into your own account. Yes, you get one of these for free. And it has the battery in it, by the way. So that's free. Now, if you buy nothing more, you don't get free shipping until you spend $49. So uh, it'll be $5 shipping. There's the box, okay? So, but, I mean, you know, you can get the M1T Raider. I like this. This is a great little EVCable, 550 lumens. The first click is the low, and the second click is the high, and that's all this thing does. That's it. And it just runs on the CR123A. But there you go. You can get the crenulated one instead of this one, and it has a high-low as well. So those are really cool. Of course, this is summertime, so I've got this baby. One of my all-time favorites for carry, and I've got it on the charger thing. See? I mean, these are just magnetic. I uh, just think it's on the charger. But this is the 1100. And this is the S2R Baton 2. To give you the battery on this one too, it's all rechargeable. This goes up to 1100 uh, lumens. It is bright as get out. And of course, there's your strobe and all that kind of stuff. Very adjustable. A little bit longer, but man, what a great little carry flashlight. And then, of course, this flat dark earth will be for this dog right here, the Seeker 2 Pro. I've got one of these, uh, but Flat Dark Earth will be a really cool color. It'll look really awesome. 3,200 lumens. Look at the, uh, the emitters in here. Um, this is crazy. It's really compact, but talk about it'll light up the room. 3,200 lumens. Uh, and you might want to. It also has that magnetic charger, but see... You can get the little bracket and they give you the screws and everything. Bingo, you're on. So tear it away, put it back, and you have the charger on the back side of here. So that's just a heads up. That's happening 12th through the 14th. Also the Warrior, which is going to be in that green, kind of an olive drab green, a new color for them. But that'll be so limited, they'll probably sell out Friday. So if you want that, that has an attachment for your... Uh, rifle your weapon, you know, and so they have weapon lights as well. They're really good and they all have that or at least the ones I know have the magnetic charging thing. So Olight, don't forget. Bastion, 
I did the uh, review on the Braza last year, and I did a review of the Persuader because I got that. It's all Wes's fault. He's like, I love that Persian style blade. Oh, they're on sale, like 52 bucks. It's titanium, it's D2, it's a beautiful blade. I'm gonna get one, I go, eh, crap. So I got one too. Now I did the Persuader, I've sent it in for testing so it's gone, so I can't show it to you. But here it is, um, Bastion, I sent them a link saying, free advertising, I, I did a review on your product just in case you cared. And they got back to me and said, hey, um, we've got other knives. Maybe you'd like to look at some of those. So also, we'd like to give your viewers a discount, 20% off. I mean, one of my viewers, of course, abused, abused Bastion gear badly during the 4th of July weekend because they were having a 30% off sale. And so he used the LTK discount code for 20% more. And I think he got the damn Persuader for like $36. So... Smart shopper there. But I'm just saying, LTK discount code, 20% off. Keep it in the back of your mind for when uh, Labor Day comes up. I'll, I mean, I know they did a Memorial Day. They did a 4th of July. If they do one on uh, Labor Day, bingo, bango, right? And I got the Bastion Flight right here. So this thing's like, a, it, it's D2. It's uh, G10, this is green, you can get it in other colors. But this one is just, you know, just your D2 um, flipper, you know, carry user. But it's like 49 something dollars, but then 20% discount. Use the link I give you and the discount code I give you and take advantage of 20% off. Um, I don't know if it applies to other gear other than knives. Give it a shot. I mean, uh, might as well. Big announcement. Stay with me on this. What do we got? We got DL tra DLT trading. Why do we got them? Because they're going to do the paramilitary 2, Sprint Run, M390, Red Scales. You know, like the ones on, on eBay on the secondary market that everybody wants like 350 bucks for. Negatory, they're good buddy. It's like $159, limit two per household. So I believe it's at 11 a.m. on the 17th, Central Time. That would be noon Eastern. Double check, look, make sure you have all your stuff updated. But then when the clock ticks, refresh the screen, it'll let you add it to your cart, check out quickly and you will own one of these little baby dolls. I'll be there with you, brother. It just keeps getting better. Tepe Designs. So, Sean Hassan, who lives out in the Bay Area, and, you know, the only problem I had with San Francisco is I went to Nancy Pelosi's house, knocked on the door, and I don't know, they just, they took one look at me and they slammed it in my face. They were just rude as hell. So I go, oh, there you go, that's... Maybe it could have been because I was wearing this. <laughs> oh my God. I always want to infuriate the lap. Half my family's all very, very progressive left wing. And so I always just love, yeah, it's just fun. You know, it's fun. Uh, so, but the Hornet, which I have reviewed. Yes. Yes, yes, very nice, comes in titanium as well. Contact him, link to his Instagram, mention LTK, get 10% off. This is D2 and uh, G10, but it's got a really cool pocket clip and all this. And the, I've got the uh, titanium one. I just decided I'm gonna go ahead and buy a titanium one too. I mean, I bought this too, I didn't get it for free. I know, everybody thinks everybody gets shit for free. I wish, ask my wife. But, so I'm gonna get the titanium one too. I know it's an N690, but it's like 160 bucks all in. I, I still think that's a hell of a deal, and this guy is a guy you wanna watch. Because, 
the Tucson TS-128 Dynamo, okay? Really cool knife that he did for Tucson. But my favorite today, the Shockwave. TS-134 Shockwave. Purple, gold, silver, the Shockwave. Very cool. M390 got that in for testing. Of course, I don't have any of this shit here. It's all in for testing. Damn it. Whenever it gets back, I'll have some knives. You know that? And the Killage. And I cut the tip of the blade off. Sorry. Killage coming out. Coming out soon. Okay? So he's doing some stuff. Wow. I, I, I mean, sometimes you don't even realize who these guys are until you wade in for a while and you go, Oh, QSP. QSP is doing it. You see the QSP Songbird? This is titanium. This is carbon fiber inlaid on both sides. This is a, uh, it's not a flipper. It's a flicker. But wow, nice. S35VN. I'm going to go ahead and have it run it in, get an HRC on it and stuff. But... Wow, it's slender, but it's it's a full size knife. That's three and three quarter inch blade there. Uh, it's just wow, nice action on it. Really feels solid. I'm going QSP. Look at this box with a slide out drawer, and you know you got. I mean, you got a pouch and everything in here. Wow, that's amazing. Then, micarta scales with titanium. VG10 on this one. Now, they have the JaVale, which is a D2. But this right here, wow, the Locust. And with the cutout there, yeah, you can finger flick it as well. This big knife, this is full-size knife too. Okay, full-size knife. Wow. That, um, yeah, that's really cool. And yeah, the liner show, it's real structural. Solid knife. Wow. So, I'm impressed with QSP. They're coming out with all these different models now. They are kicking butt. Pay attention to them. White Mountain Knives for the QSP. Pay attention. Oh, Kaiser, they're finally getting a lot of their knives out that they had promised at the SHOT Show in January. Microlith. The Microlith. This is a Nick Swan design. He did a Microlith, uh, you know, custom. It was 700 and some dollars. But this is Kaiser S35VN. But you can also get this in carbon fiber. And it's a liner lock, okay, but it's full titanium, okay, but small, small little knife, just small little knife. Uh, great action for a little tiny knife. Look at that. Look at the flipper tab. There's nothing to it. Thanks for nothing. Whoop. Bam. Yeah. Whoo. Very light detent, though. Yeah. Very light detent, but... Mmm. Interesting. Microlith. Stay up with Kaiser. One other thing I want to get back to you on. Hey, be looking in the future um, that uh, for CH Knives, the CH Man. CH Man, I don't know. Was it like Leather Man? <laughs> Who names this shit? Nighthawk. So this is not only... Um, well, the Nighthawk I have in G10, but I sent it in. Come on, class. I sent it in for testing. Yeah, it's not back yet. But these are the uh, titanium ones. The front is carbon fiber. So this will probably not be a knife that I'm going to be crazy about because carbon fiber, titanium, I don't, I don't like that. But what the hell? The CH Man looks interesting. But then also the Butcher. Cool. 
Now, these should be coming to a White Mountain Knives near you and me, my friends. So, I'm asking about him. He hasn't got them last I checked, but they should be able to be available because he's going to carry CH line. Two things. Don't forget my buddy Power Cutlery. Okay. Power Cutlery. The FH61 is here. FH61, it's a little brute. It's a little knife. It's cool. It's got great action on it, though. And middle finger flick as well. Comes in different colors. Get them on Power Cutlery. They got them. They got the 11s, the 12s, the, the 21s, 31s, 41s, 51s, and now 61s on there okay and another thing just in case you're interested because you like the old school there you go this is the 7651 okay this kind of got that grayish bluish as well and left hand carry see the plate deep carry pocket clip this is 440 this is not d2 for those of you who don't want a corrosive. I mean, you want a true stainless. There you go, 440. And it's got your little G-lock. Uh, beautiful action on it. Comes in different colors. This is a new model as well. So remember Power Cutlery, USA dealer, like $3 for shipping. So buy several because he only charged me three bucks uh, when I bought three knives. So it gets cheaper then, right? Don't forget my buddy Steve at Blades We Love. And I threw him in here with Rogue Blade Works. A uh, couple of things to think about. First of all, he's doing this. If you guys haven't seen any of this, this is the Paramilitary 2. Okay? What's going on here? We got a button lock, don't we? Yes, we do. So there's going to be this special run of knives. And you can get them... Go on to his site, Blades We Love, his website. You can look down here and it'll give you options. Let me see if I got stuff. Well, and here's, here's you know, scales. Scales, different colored scales, different color hardware, or you can keep the original hardware and not get the titanium hardware that's anodized, but you can do that as well. You can get a sculpted clip. You can get a certain type of clip. So that you got all kinds of options on here. It should be interesting, huh? Uh, wow, cool. Oh, by the way, uh, Spyderco smock. I'm going to get a smock from him as well with all the titanium stuff on it, blue titanium, but I'm going to get the white scales. I'm going to get it all dressed up. I'll put it on my channel. I'll show it to you. I think that'd be really, really cool too. And I know that he has the hardware for the Benchmade bailout, bug out, the pocket clips as well. In the past, he didn't have the pocket clips, but now he's got pocket clips and the anodized titanium screws. And he obviously is getting scales now. I don't know what all models he's got scales for. Contacting him as contact him as well. I'll give you the link also for Rogue Blade Works. Rogue Blade Works. Okay, so here's scales for bailout bug out and i don't know what other scales they make i don't but this is you can go on their regular website for rogue blade works and they'll give you a link on their site to go to their etsy channel where you can buy this stuff so check that out as well you can get carbon fiber you can get other colored g10 scales for these things that's yeah that's cool that's really cool trader's corner we got flat, big flashlight sale, 12th through the 16th. Go with Blades We Love. You can go and pre-order one of those crazy para twos or DLT trading. Get you one of those sprint runs. You know, pay attention to power cutlery and all the new Ganzos coming out. Stay up with that. White Mountain Knives. Got CH knives, but any knife. 10% off on White Mountain Knives. Any knife. Any number of times. Not just once. Every day, you want to go back, load it up, whatever, 10% off, free shipping in the U.S. of A. Do that. Uh, Tuya knives, Kingsman and Costova are the new ones out now. 
Wow. Uh, so it just keeps rocking over it to you as well. And nice to support people who are USA dealers where swap, boom. You, anything, you, you need this or you need that, extra hardware, whatever, you can get it. He responds immediately. That's great people to do business with. We got it all going. Thank you so much. Trader's Corner, you know what we do around here? We love them knives. Yes, we do. Stay sharp.